What's going on guys, Paul Tech here today. Today I want to share with you my LG G2. Now on this device, I currently use it on Metro PCS. Yes, that's correct. You can use a LG G2 and most Verizon devices on Metro PCS, T-Mobile, and some other carriers. Real nice looking LG G2 here. It's like in pristine condition. Really love this device. I can't part with this device. This is one device I'll just keep until it breaks on me. But let me go ahead and tell you, you can use this and it works pretty well. There are some features that won't work on Metro PCS uh, and some other carriers just because they are some features that are just a Verizon exclusive. You have to be on Verizon's plan in order to access those features. One of the features is, I'll go ahead and open up the dialer here, is the video calling feature. Now, this device does have the video calling feature like the LG Stylo, Stylo 2, J7, but uh, I can't access it on this device because I have to be on Verizon's plan in order to use it. So that's one of the features that doesn't work, unfortunately, because I really like that feature. And that's why I like Metro PCS devices, because it's just built right into the dialer. But instead, I would have to go to advanced calling. Let me go to settings here real quick. So in order to get that feature, I have to go to advanced calling, activate advanced calling. And this right here is how you will activate the uh, video calling feature, but it won't allow me to do that, unfortunately. But there are some other features that do work, and they work very well on this device on Metro PCS. So in order to get this device working on Metro PCS, let's go ahead and hit more. More networks. System select. So network mode. So most Verizon devices has this mode right here, the global mode. So the G2 has it, uh, S6 has it, uh, S7 Edge I believe has it as well. I'll have to double check. But if you uh, want to use this on other carriers, just hit the global mode there and you'll be able to use this on other carriers. So that's what I did here. Hit global. Now this device does have a SIM card slot there, so I popped in my Metro PCS SIM card already. As you can see, this is on 4G LTE. I'm not connected to Wi-Fi or anything like that. Next, once you choose global mode, you got your SIM card in, you wanna to go to APN now. Now you have to set this up in order to get the features to work. So APN settings, you have to have the settings in there. So I have it right there, it's on. If you don't know the APN settings, look at another Metro PCS device you might have and go to access point names and you can get it from there or call customer service and they should walk you through setting up an APN on your device. Um, that's what I do and it works every single time. So you set up that and basically you're good to go. Power your phone uh, off and on and you should be ready to go. I'll go ahead and give you a sample here. Metro PCS. 4G LTE, not on Wi-Fi, so I am using this on Metro PCS right here. So there you have it. So yeah, if you do own a LG G2 for Verizon, you can definitely use this on Metro PCS, T-Mobile, and some other carriers. This is a global device. It is unlocked, so you don't have to pay for it to be unlocked. As long as it has a clean IMEI number, your device is paid off, and you are and you will definitely be good to go. As you can see, I just got a notification there on 4G LTE, another email there. So yeah, everything works pretty well. Like I said, there are gonna be some features that don't work 100% just because this is not designed for Metro PCS. But if you want, you can go ahead and download the My Metro app and you just get that off the Google Play Store and then you'll have access to your account right there. So yeah. So this is a pretty good device. I know this is an older device, but I'm sure there are people out there that do still have their LG G2. It's paid off. It's sitting in the drawer maybe. Or if you come across one, they're real cheap on Craigslist, eBay. You can get these devices for about 100 bucks right now. And this is a good quality, solid device. I mean, I love the G2. And it has a great camera on it, a nice display. Uh, a lot of great features still with this older flagship device. So yeah, this was just a quick video on my LG G2 on Metro PCS. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe for more future videos. This is Paul Tech, and I'll talk to you on the next one.